So I've just been working on this drive, trying to recover the dates out of it. It was it was absolutely dead. Obviously, I was hoping I could take it out of its enclosure and it would work, but I can't. <laughs> so I'm stripping this out. I've took the numbers of the board, thinking that you could buy a replacement, but then I watched a video saying that you're probably going to need to reflash the the uh, firmware on it or change the firmware chip. So. I don't really know which one the firmware chip is, but it looks like it's going to be built into one of these chips, so it ain't going to be easy. But anyway, I'll clean these contacts because one video said that that could help, and they were filthy. And clean these contacts on here, so that's worth a try. But it ended up being, I don't know if you can see, but there. There, there was a diode there, like one of these things, like a black little, well it's a diode, <laughs> and that was shorted. So I sort of desoldered that, made a bit of a mess on the connector, but that stopped it. So you want to check to see if it's shorted, you can find the, obviously you can find the pins on there. I don't know exactly know which ones they are to be honest. But all I did was plug it into me little hard drive docking station and then test it between the live and the neutral of the incoming power. And I could tell I had a short, so I knew something on this board was shorted. And it ended up being that diode there. So I've done that, I'll put it back together, I can boot this hard drive now and I'll recover the data for the person. So, so much to test anyway, clean the contacts, if not, look for shorts on the board.